I'm here with Coach McCourt and Adam Shaw for this week's edition of the Coach's Corner. Uh, Coach McCourt, last week you guys put six points on the board early in the game, but after that you really didn't get the offense going. And your defense held Salem to the last five minutes of the game. Did you guys, were there defensive assignments that were missed? As far as was there assignments that were missed in the fourth quarter, you mean? Yeah. In the last um, five minutes. You know, the, the, there was, uh, of course, any time they score points, I would say that there was obviously assignments that were missed. There was things that we didn't do or, or uh, plays we didn't make. Uh, you know, as I've told you before, you know, one of the good things about this group of young men is, is we've got a lot of young players that we're asking to do uh, a lot of things. And, and some of those things um, that they have to do uh, on a Friday night are, are, are sometimes things that um, it's tough for a junior and a senior to do. And we're asking them to pick it up and to do it right now. Uh, and so for some of these young guys, there's just little things that we just got to fine tune. The thing that I love, and, and I told these guys after film on Saturday, is I love our effort. Uh, I, I love the fact that when you look out there, our guys are flying around. Did we miss some opportunities? Yeah, we did. We, you know, we, we, there was an opportunity for us to make a play on a ball in, in the end zone. We had two guys there, and he jumped up and made a really good play. Um, uh, there was opportunities for us to, uh, to, to get a couple sacks, and, and things happened, and, and we, we didn't do that. Um, you know, we got to make the most out of the opportunities that, that come our way, uh, and part of that is just is just growing in this game and having some young guys step up and, and, and continue to play better each week. So. And you guys have a lot of sophomores playing up. Mm -hmm. Do you have any freshmen playing up? No, no, there's no freshmen at this point in time. Just a lot of sophomores uh, and, and a lot of juniors, and and uh, uh, and we have great senior leadership, but. Uh, you know, sometimes, like I, you know, like I said, the, those those young guys, they got to learn quickly. Okay, and at the end of the first half, when the chains were moved after you got the first down, you spiked the ball. And then you went to second down, and then on third down, you spiked the ball. Did you not have a second play ready? We didn't, and that's something that, that, that we got to do better as, as a coaching staff, as, a, as an offensive coaching staff, you know, the, you know. We got to we got to make sure that we have two plays ready to, ready to rock and roll in a moment like that. Uh, and no, we you know we called one play, um, thinking that something else was, was going to happen. And, and uh, um, you know we, we've got to be be better at that, and that falls on us. Did you see any improvement Friday night from your younger kids that uh, are I, starting to get more playing time? There's there's no question that that, that there's. There was some improvement, and we we faced a very very good Salem team, very good Salem team. Um, I think that there was a lot of missed opportunities, both on offense and on defense, that we could have done some things. And and uh, but uh, um, yeah, there's 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 no question that I'm seeing some of these young kids pick it up, and more importantly, what I notice is on film they're starting to recognize the things that they're going wrong. Um, and as the weeks progress, they're, they're going to keep getting better and better. And Adam, uh, what benefits what benefits do you like from moving from wide receiver last year to playing quarterback this year? Uh, I feel like I have more control of the game. I feel like I can be a better leader and help my team win. Now, are there any downfalls? Well, I mean, you do have the responsibility aspect of it. If you win, you get praised for it. If you lose, then you're like kind of blame. And going into this week, looking at game film, what are your strengths that you think you have to compete against the Lions? I feel like I'm improving in my passing game, and I feel like we have a strong running backs, so I feel like we can do whatever we want. All right, and Coach McCourt, uh, do you think that your team has played better in the six games than your record shows? Well, there's, there's no question. I, I mean, I, I feel like we're – just a, a play or two away, and, and sometimes, you know, again, you know, you look at the last three weeks, and, and we're in all the way to the third and the fourth quarter, um, and then some of those mistakes kind of take over. Um, but I think that we're playing much better than what our record shows. I think that through our through some of the injuries that we've had to to deal with, you know, from from week to week, 
uh, and some some key guys being out, but some some young guys have stepped up and, and tried to fill those roles. Um, and I think that there's a lot of positives to take away. And the thing that I know I've told you uh, is the way that these guys handle themselves. And I'm so proud of the way that these guys uh, come out every day for practice, and, and their their heads are high, and and, and they're continuing to compete. They, you know, I've got a kid like Adam that's that's wanting to to get better. He wants to learn. You know, he knows he's not doing everything perfect, but he's, you know, uh, and, and he's wanting to get better and better every single day and every single week. Uh, and it's fun to coach those guys. It's fun to be out there on, on the field with those guys. And and, and uh, so for that, you know, I, you know, I, I think we're improving each week just just because kids want to get better. So. All right. Thank you, guys. Yep.